Deadlines are brutal. Clients want magic. And your creative energy? Yeah, that's you running on fumes. If you're a designer, you know the pain, endless coffee, late nights, and rounds of feedback that make you want to start a new career in goat farming. But what if your next creative breakthrough came from a toy soldier? Today, we're diving into how Midjourney 7 can actually solve real design problems, idea generation, characters with consistency, and better compositions that allow you to have more fun. We're talking about Midjourney version 7, which has an all wrap this up in one clean, brilliant upgrade. And we're using one consistent theme, these classic green plastic army men, so you can spot the differences, feel the upgrades, and see exactly how this can level up your design workflow. By the end of this video, you'll know if Midjourney's version 7 is ready for your client's work or just another toy in the toolbox. Version 7 finally understands what you mean, not just what you type, thanks to natural language understanding in draft mode. It's built to help you iterate fast. And we're gonna show this by showing you how this works in draft mode with the microphone on. I'm just gonna speak into the microphone and watch what happens. Realistic olive drab plastic army men lined up in a row, white background. Make it four army men. Close up on one, make him smiling. It understood the live prompting, improved realism and detail, but look closer. Version 7 now flexes on the sharper details. Here's how where you can focus on what's important and also add more character consistency so you can build out a sequence for a marketing campaign or other visuals. Same toy soldier, different scene, from a yoga mat to the battlefield, your character stays the same. Now let's focus on stylistic control. You can vary the amount of creativity that Midjourney injects into the scene with a style control from zero to 1000, Midjourney has tightened this up with smaller numbers, giving you a closer to the prompt look and larger numbers with more creative ideas that are expressed. Another improvement is in layout composition. With the right prompts, your ideas in version seven can actually stay in formation. Left flank, Center line, evenly spaced, watch your troops fall in line. But sometimes you get the oddball thing that uh, doesn't really look so good like this soldier's leg. No need to nuke the whole image when we can just edit the leg that we don't like. We just erase it, hit submit. And we get four new choices that we like. I like this first one. Finally, sometimes you need to create a sequence. Here's where image consistency is important. From the first image to the next, to the last. In short, Midjourney version seven isn't just smarter, it's sharper, faster, and feels like it's really built for creative work. If you wanna to continue to keep leveling up and stay ahead of the curve, join the Midjourney Experience community and newsletter. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching, see you.